we wanted to be able to support teachers um, around quality teaching and learning. So part of what we did was we provide time here every Tuesday for teachers to go and observe each other. And then we have a practice analysis conversation afterwards. We had one of my leaders observe in every classroom the targeted student teaching. And so we were able to collate from that what we believed our strengths were as a school. We also had wonderings around, we're not sure about some of these parts here, which we then shared with everybody. And so that provided a collective understanding and it gave us a real focus on where we needed to go next and what learning we needed to do collectively. Amazing! Well done! The observer gets lots of really good ideas and it hones that person's practice because we have to really be looking to seeing what deliberate acts of teaching are happening here. As a leader, you have to think about what question am I going to ask this teacher to support them to think about their next learning steps. It's not just about telling the teacher what they're doing well and what they need to do next because that doesn't always work. Because it has to come from them, doesn't it? It has to be important and meaningful to that person, not to me, to that person. Kelly has facilitated us to have every Tuesday. There's a reliever available in the school and we can decide if we want to go and observe someone else's practice within the school or it's even been going and observing other schools practices. It's a great way to see the progressions, to be able to go and observe the year lower down than me, this is what they're doing, so then am I following this up in my class? 